forgot in kidding season and day of the week, no idea. Uh, but we have another baby on the ground here. Let's go check. I missed this one. I've been filming a lot, but I missed this one. But uh, here we go. These are the mamas yet to kid. I have seven left. And so you are definitely new. Yeah, you are new, honey. Now, who is your mama? Why aren't they over here, huh? Where's your mommy? Where's your mama? Let's go find out. They're standing and everything. I figured number eight. Number eight, it is. Where's your little baby? Don't you hear him? You are a little boy. Big boy. Holy bucket, too big. Huh? Oh, big boy. We should weigh you. Yeah. That's a sign of a good mommy. You notice there, she's got two, I have a couple goats with two teats on each side. And some of them actually give milk out, both of them. And I've actually got milk out of three, sometimes four, sometimes just the two. Just some fun facts for you there. <laughs> Still gonna bring her to the kidding pen uh, for that bonding time, but it looks like she's gonna be a great mom. Wouldn't really need to move her, but I'm gonna move her anyways. Time to get um, number 16 out anyway. She's been in there a week already, so. She's well okay to be back with everybody.
There we go. Everything is freshly bedded. I do a combination of a little bit of corn straw because it holds more moisture and then wheat straw. It's finer. So I do a little bit of both on each pen. Let's go see if they're enjoying it. Nibbling on some corn straw already. <laughs> All right, girly. It is your time to move up in the world. <laughs> done fighting. No, not yet. Some would say that's just a male thing. It's not. The girls do it too. <laughs> Always fighting.
little bit here. Got your own crib now. <laughs> and I'm going to write it in my sheet here. There we go. Going to hang out now, huh? 